be showing you how to do a tutorial to make your face look like slender man ignore my gorm ish of a face because i know i do look like a moron but i'm only using this photo for the purpose of this tutorial right so what you want to do is there's a brush right here i'm not sure if you can see my mouth but if you can right there this plaster one you click that you click the healing brush or the spot healing brush I, 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 no, I just think it's just stealing brush. What you do is you hold down Alt, left Alt. I don't know if right Alt works. I'll try it. Oh, I don't know what just happened. One second. It's. I pressed the wrong. M. Yeah. L right Alt doesn't work. So left Alt next to the Windows and Control. If you don't know where that is, you're a moron. But yeah, so you press left Alt you click somewhere roughly under the lips because we'll start with the lips so click right there and then that and you click there and drag and I don't know if you can see but very faintly there's a little arrow just underneath going under there so there's there I know that looks a bit strange but watch keep going over that and over that and eventually it will start to vanish See, as you can see now, the line from my lip is already starting to go. So just keep doing this for a while. And eventually it will be gone. So yeah, I'll just keep talking as I'm making it. So then what you do, if you can't tell, you could probably make this look better for yourself. Oh, if I'm honest, I'm not very good at this. But I just thought I'd make a quick tutorial for those who didn't know what they're doing. Go alt, go from the top as well this time. There we go, down there. And across there. Right under here. So yeah, you get the point, you just cross. So look at that now. My face is gone. I know it looks a bit rough, but that's because of how high quality my photo is at. Look. It's only because high quality though, so it looks a bit rough. But you, I'm pretty sure you are... I'm not sure if you got a good camera, I'm not saying you won't. I'm just saying you might not. So yours will be easier to do, and it won't look as rough as this does. Doop doo Right, that looks a bit rough. So I'm just going to get rid of the edge of the nose. While doing this. Maybe make the brush a little bit smaller. Down there, round there, round there. Drag that there, round the edges. There's that bit gone. Click from the top. I know I look like a moron, but deal with it. Click there, get rid of that bit. Boop. I'm just going to get rid of the nose completely, but what you can do, I'll show you as I'm doing it though, but I'm getting rid of it. You can do. Is you're going to end up wanting to get, you're going to probably end up doing this and completely getting rid of the shadow on the side of your nose. Oh no, you could do it like that. But I'm, I'm getting rid of it because I just don't want a face. Who wants, who wants faces to make? But look, like that. So you know you've got no nostrils. Actually, I might just leave the nose as it is. Now nah, I'm getting rid of it just because then once I've got rid of it, that means I could put a face on it. Like, I might just put shoot the whoop or something like that, just because just it might look pretty funny. But yeah, that's how you do that if you want to look like Slender Man, you know, like have some of the features there but nothing actually there. So, what I'm going to do now is click here and just slowly rub away that bit. You have to work quite a bit when you're doing the nose. Um, see, the best thing is to click next to it, so make sure you've clicked. Every, all, all the time clicking near it because if you click over here and then you're like working on the eye it won't match what's under the eye so you want to blend it in with your skin and I'll go back to those in a second so let's go to over to the eye right, corner of the eye and then draw right under it you're, you on yours you'll probably be able to see across but you probably won't be able to see it very well on this there's that bit alt again top just going across Bear in mind this is a very simple tutorial, very simple. 
I'm not going into all like the see I messed up there because I forgot to change the old bear in mind this is a yeah that's what I'm saying bear in mind this is a very simple tutorial I'm not showing through like how to make it look like properly pro I'm just doing this for those who aren't very familiar with Photoshop and it's pretty easy to do as you can tell all you've got to do is just have a lot of patience really ain't it so just keep clicking alt, dragging around there, across there, yeah I'm just, because I have nothing to say because I'm a very boring person, all I'm going is there, there, and there, right, you get the point. So all you've got to basically do is just flick around, and see I don't like that little pink thing there, so I'm just going to get rid of that, just because, yes, because I don't sleep very often. Because, I don't know, I just can never sleep. But yeah, so look, it's already turned out pretty well. That looks a bit bad, but yeah, I could probably clean up a bit more. So there's one eye gone. Could just leave it like that if you wanted. Do whatever you want. This is just a simple tutorial of how to get rid of it. So alt over here, around that edge, up here, around there, around there. So just, oh, see, that's where I messed up because I have to keep messing up with the alt. because if you do that look it's like added where it had it if you get what I mean so I'm just going to do it from the side instead and then from this top bit right around there you've got to be careful where the other arrow goes because look it sometimes so look that's just added another part of my island so I'm going to go a bit higher instead I hope this is helping you by the way because it should be very simple to do I'm not very really making it complicated am I if I am um, just tell me and I can try and make another one for you if that's what you'd want but yeah I'm, I don't really tend to make videos specifically on anything I'm just doing whatever I feel like I don't really have a schedule either do you think anyone think I should have a schedule that's something I should try and do if you want me to have a schedule god if you want me to have a schedule just um let me know because I don't really know what people want I don't really see many people watch my videos if you don't really watch my video you may as well check them out just click on my channel whatever you want to do I'm not telling you to do anything I'm just doing this tutorial for you across there look see what I mean the little this red where it's darker where that shadow was there we go oh slender man could leave the eyebrows on, do what you want, but this tutorial, as I've said multiple times now, is just for making everything go away. Remember you have to keep pressing Alt when you go in different places, so that it stays. Because what it does is it tries to match it with the things next to it, it blurs them together. So it's blurring it with, if I, I'm just going to delete a bit, if I went over there, got my ear, and started drawing it, I could draw out my ear over here. Draw your ear on your face, you could use this for the thing you put up. See, that's my ear on my face. So I'm pretty sure you could find other things to do, but if you don't really find other things to do and there's something you wanted to do, let me know and I can try and um, help you out with that. Just, yeah. Doing what you guys want. I've talked to a few people at school, telling them about this, and they're like, how do you do it? So I just thought make it sorry, will make it easier. I don't have to explain it um, multiple times turned out pretty well it doesn't look very good I'll admit but you know I'm pretty sure you'll probably spend more time more effort because most of you are probably better than me at using it or you care more about what you're doing I don't know maybe but yeah my eyebrows are gone now face is pretty much gone now I'm just going to get rid of my nose completely. This will probably crack up a bit, but you know. Oh well. Right, across there. Bam. Bam. See, look, see where I've got a spot there and it's just gone straight across. So what I'm going to do is go down that side. Drag it down there. Match it all up. So I don't want those lines. I don't know if you can see them very well. 
maybe you can, maybe you can't. But there's little lines on there which I don't want where you can see where I've drawn the bush sideways, which is probably a bad idea to do now that I think about it. So like, I keep getting these little darts which I don't want. So I'm just gonna try and pick a clean area of skin. Not probably there, just boop. And if you keep clicking it will try and copy that. I'm not the best, but I just thought I found out how to do this and I thought, oh, share it. See? It looks pretty bad now because I'm completely getting rid of it. But I will do something else and I will show you what I've done afterwards. But yeah, just if this is where you want to end the video, you can. I hope this helped. Thank you for watching. Stick around if for just a little longer if you want to see what I've just done. It'll probably be about now. So yeah, just one second. Yeah, this is what I've done. Basically, that's it. I just wanted to add a face. That's why it didn't look very well around the outside. But the thing I've done here, I probably could have, you know, just put that over my face anyway. But if it, once I've got rid of it, now I'm pretty sure this is probably easier because of the mouth and things in the way. But yeah, I'm just saying that you can do things like that. Just, you could have any other face on it. Oh, there's no face. There's a face. Blah. Anyway, yeah, I hope this tutorial helps you. I've just said that a second ago, but yeah, oh well. I hope this tutorial's helped you. Please like the video if if it helps. Just like it anyway if you want. Not really too first, but it'll help if you did like it, because then I know that you like this kind of things, and I know to do more about like this in the future. So yeah, this is a very simple tutorial. Hope it helped. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.